Bro, you seen those Flyers? Flyers lose four to one to the Pittsburgh Penguins. And what could have been four points out of a playoff spot is now eight points out of a playoff spot. Carter Hart looked average for once and Matt Murray actually looked incredible. Flyers peppered him with 51 shots and he made 50 saves. And the uh, only goal that we scored was on a late penalty by Pittsburgh and we'll get right into that. So early on, Sidney Crosby burns us again, wide open on the side of the net, tucks it past Carter Hart on the backside. Uh, it didn't get over in time, but again, Crosby shouldn't be left that wide open. One of the best players in the game and you're leaving him wide open. Both D cheated to one side and this guy's just all alone. So one nothing Pittsburgh. Stayed this way for a while and uh, they just get a couple more goals, 3 nothing, and uh, then something incredible would happen. Uh, Michael Raffle would get under the skin of Evgeny Malkin, and uh, not so incredible. This guy, we've been able to get under his skin a lot lately. Not lately, but the last 10 years. Basically, guy swings his stick at Raffle's head, gets ejected, five games, indefinite suspension. So he might not be there at the outdoor game if, the, if they try to crack down on him but uh, I doubt it it's Pittsburgh you know he's gonna be back for that uh, they want to fill the seats so 4-1 loss the job is now a little bit tougher eight points but I don't think we played terribly I just think we didn't capitalize we didn't finish and Carter Hart had to have one of those days I mean the second goal I don't know if it went under his leg it was hard to tell on the replay but it went, I don't know if it went under his leg between his legs or right under his glove but softy and uh, third goal also was another softy. So two soft goals. The first goal, I don't really blame him because the D didn't help him out. But uh, yeah, I don't know. It wasn't his night today. And uh, he still tied the record for most wins in a row under the age of 21. So you can't complain too much. But next game, we got Detroit. Again, we got to keep winning. We got to look forward. We cannot be harping on these games. <sighs> The only thing I didn't like about this game, to be honest, was the line matching by Scott Gordon. He's been all right so far this year, but I think that Couturier has to be on with Malkin. He gets under his skin. He's gotten under his skin before, and Malkin hates him. And Giroux and Crosby got to be on together. But he was kind of switching it up. He didn't want Crosby on Giroux, it looked like, and he wanted Couturier on Crosby. And I don't know. In my opinion, you go with what worked before for you, and uh, Couturier on Malkin seem to have worked in the past, and that's just my opinion. So guys, like the video, subscribe. We'll wait again for you to subscribe. It's over there, right there. See, like I'm tilting the phone, right there. Barrow, you seen those flyers?